Hey kids, it's me, Tony. Nope, you don't see my face. You wanna know why? Because I'm getting over my third bout of pink eye. Yes, if you wanna see how it looked when it was really bad, I'll insert a picture here. So, I'm getting over that. And I have a giant zit on my nose. My hair is a mess because I have, I don't know, I have quarantine-itis or something. I just have turned into a hermit. If there were a cave, I think I would live in it. Anyway, I don't know how anybody else is feeling about it. I'm kind of like over the whole COVID thing, you know, like can we just go on now? So, meanwhile, I have a couple of uh, unboxings. One is, this one, is a, um, something I got from Coach. They were having a sale for Mother's Day. I had gotten my sister a little something, and so it was like, oh, I'll get me a little something, too. And then the other is a handbag from a place called Handbag Crave. They do uh, knockoffs, not replicas, not fakes. They do knockoffs, so um, they, they look like certain handbags or remind you of certain handbags, but there's no logos, there's no anything like that, so they don't pretend to be that brand that maybe is famous for that particular handbag. So um, I'll put the link to that and also to uh, another YouTuber by the name of Autumn Beckman. Uh, she's a great channel. She does luxury on a budget. And she does uh, things like that where it's um, knockoff. She actually does, I mean, she does buy things from um, either the resellers like Fashion File, The Real Real, or from Louis Vuitton or the other uh, luxury houses themselves. So she's the one uh, that showing this uh, handbag crave company I think they had sent her sort of a, a, a Birkin dupe and so I went to their website and a lot of their stuff is more than I usually pay for a handbag but they had a clearance area so I'm all for clearance so this other bag I bought there because it's reminiscent of a uh, Louis Vuitton uh, Denny Abin so but let's open up the wallet first. How are you guys coping with all this craziness? Are you sick of it? This is We Need Diversion. And as usual, I had them um, gift wrap it, sort of, which apparently they didn't really do. Um, I guess they weren't really into gift wrapping. Maybe wallets, you don't get a box of any kind. Anyway. This is a soft wallet. I haven't had a soft wallet, I don't think, before. But it's their color block. And I just thought it was cute. Oh, yeah. This is very nice. So there it is. So it has... This is sort of a light rose color. I think it's coming across. And then a real pretty blue. And then sort of a camel colored back. And the blue extends over to here, and there's a zippered part here, and let's look on the inside, so, so original cost was 150 which of course I would never pay, I think I bought this for maybe around 70 anyway, I think that's right, anyway, really pretty, has the logo on the front of course, and then when you open it, it's just, the inside is black. Let's see, get where you can kind of see it. So, there's a place for cards and a slip pocket back here. And then, it looks like, there's additional places to put cards here. So, it's really simple. It's not um, anything too fancy. But, I liked it because it's soft. And so... I tend to put a lot of things in and sometimes those a regular wallet might kind of not do well but this is really anyway 
I thought it was really pretty. Of course, they have uh, bags that go with this in the same color block, but I didn't do that. But I do have um, a bag that I got, I think it's a Michael Kors bag, that is sort of this pinky color. I thought it would go real well if we ever get to go out in public and feel like we can be real people without stupid little masks on. I will use it. I want, you know, I, uh, I don't know. I'm so sick of this whole thing. Anyway, that's just my little private thought there. Anyway, so that's that. So let me put that back in its box. So, are you guys working? Are you guys laid off? Hopefully not. Um, how are y'all doing? You know, I picked a great time to retire, so I'm kind of glad. So here, um, you know, just because I was already at home, um, so that's helpful. So here's the bag. I haven't looked at the bag. I just slid it open. It doesn't come with a box. Okay. So, oh, they do look like they do give you some sort of little bag. This is Lola Benson Star Dami Damier Designer Purse Set. So, as you can tell, very uh, Louis Vuitton looking. It's a fairly good size purse. It's like a tote. Let me take it out of the plastic. Okay, so here it is. It's a sort of like a fufu never full tote. So, um, let me pull this up so you can see it like hanging up. So, um, it has this kind of cool chain with, um, amber looking, um, links and gold links with a back zipper pocket. And then in the front, you have this really pretty tassel and the LB instead of LB. Um, the tassel though is really nice. It does look to be coated canvas, very soft. And then on the inside, the inside is not spectacular. I had the phone on a stand and then I took it off because it's just easier. So um, here you'll see the Lola Benson. It, you know, it kind of mimics the Louis Vuitton uh, font and the inside of the Neverfull. It does come with a separate um, little pouch, which I like because it has the coated um, leather on the top. And it's it has like a little curved design, so it's not crooked. It's actually the leather is curved. Curved and then let's see. And then inside it's just you know a little pouch. It just has a sort of a satiny inside. But like you, you know, like I said, it, it looks very much like Louis Vuitton, except there is no stamping for Louis Vuitton and nothing on the canvas. And then, I just thought the handles were really cute. It's probably the size, I don't know. I don't know if it's the size of an MM or a PM, never full, but it does have a zipper. And then it has uh, two pockets and then a center zipper. Let's see. It's gold on the... And so it's gold on the inside. And, um, I mean, you know, the inside is not spectacular, but um, the rest of it has got feet. So I always appreciate feet, especially on a tote because you always have so much stuff in it. So I think the price on this was 
$49. I don't know if they still have it, but I will put the link for um, the uh, handbag crave. You can look through if you're looking for a dupe for a uh, for an Hermes bag or something like that, or maybe um, certain Chanel type bags. I think they have that. I think they're expanding what they have. It, they're based in England. This did ship though from the states. I know uh, sometimes they do. It does state. Um, it does. Ugh, I can't talk. I'm, I'm guys. I'm losing my mind. Well, all this stuff. Anyway, I know um, it, it does ship things from England. I I think I think Autumn, her bags came from England. So, but I'll put everything in the description box so you guys can take a look. It's just you know if you want something, you want to feel like you're carrying something but you're not really carrying something. This is the way to do it. The stitching, the stitching is okay. I think there's a couple of loose stitches here, but um, you know, for the price, I thought it was fine. And um, once you put stuff in it, it'll be great. And I think it'll be really something you can wear, and people can kind of look at it and say, "Wait, is that a Louis Vuitton?" And have a look. I love tassels. I love tassels. I love tassels. Anyway, that's all I have today. And I and they, they did give me a list of little dust bag, but it's real flimsy. So anyway, leave me a comment. Tell me how it's going for you. Tell me if you guys want to chit chat about everything that's going on. I feel the need to chit chat, but I don't want to bore you with me going on and about it. But um, anyway. I am alive and kicking. I just look hideous. So, <laughs> if you're new to my channel, I don't always look hideous. And you do usually see my face. And I do videos when I want to and about whatever I want to. A lot of times it has to do with fashion or luxury or, or um, dupes or replicas or just whatever I'm in the mood to talk about. So, if you enjoyed this uh, video, please let me know and, and hit the little like button. Apparently, that makes YouTube happy. That makes me happy. And if you'd like to subscribe, please do that as well. We are small but mighty. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye bye. Stay safe. Six feet away. We're six feet away. Can you tell? Bye.